Uh, hi guys, so in today's video I wanted to have a look at a very important part of SEO for your cleaning business and that's building your backlinks. Um, it's something that um, many, many people don't really talk about. It's probably the hardest part of building uh, a very effective SEO strategy um, and certainly if you have an established business that's doing multi, multi six figures, seven figures a year, SEO will be a big big driver of your traffic so this is super important what we're, we're about to talk through about backlinking so to, to very quickly uh, define what a backlinking strategy is uh, it's probably easiest to give you an example so um so you you have your business you have your your website set up um, and you have done what's called your on-site SEO. So you think you've done things like added content that talks about you know, the particular service that you you provide in a certain location. So say you're a cleaning company in Chicago, you know, there'd be various titles on your site talking about cleaning companies in Chicago, the paragraphs, the text, um, you know, images, videos, they would all be tagged and labeled in a similar way. Um, and that is one part of what's called your on-site um, SEO. So we assume that's all done to begin with, and then we're moving on to the backlink strategy. So really what a backlink is, is um, a, a link from any other website that directs back to your, your specific website. So as an example, um, the New York Times runs a, uh, an article about how important cleaning companies have been during the COVID pandemic. Um, maybe they've interviewed a few uh, business owners, uh, including yourself. And what they do is that they, they'll quote you and then they'll probably leave a link to say so-and-so business owner at ABC Cleaning. And there would be a link from the New York Times back to your website. So that is an example of a, a backlink. In this case, it's a very, very high quality backlink. Um, and this is what Google is doing. So when, when you are um, running an SEO strategy, effectively what you're trying to do is get Google to rank your website up for specific terms. So these are below the, 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 the Google ads positions at the very top of the page. So one of the things that they look at is what's going on your website you know how you know is there lots of content about cleaning companies in chicago or are there videos images all those sorts of things but the other thing they also want to do is is look at the quality so how relevant your website is one thing but they want to show the best quality websites over the lower quality websites and one of the ways that they do that is by looking at both the volume and the quality of backlinks so if you have got a link from the New York Times uh, website back to your uh, your homepage, that is a real, real big tick for Google. Uh, you know, obviously, it's very, very difficult to get a backlink from the New York Times. The New York Times isn't going to just give any cleaning company um, a backlink. So Google sees this as a vote, a very high quality vote. And the more high quality votes that you have, the higher you will be ranked over your competitors for those certain keywords um, that you're tracking. So one of the longer term SEO strategies when you're running a cleaning business, you know, whether it's whether if you're doing your SEO in-house or if you have an agency doing it for you, is to build backlinks and high quality backlinks. And what I have on this screenshot is just a snapshot of some of the links that we have got in my own cleaning business, so neat services. Um, and we'll talk about what some of this data means, but you can see, uh, you know, we've got some, you know, really good quality backlinks here, you know, today.com, Martha Stewart, Real Simple. These are, you know, these are well-known brands um, and, you know, these are high quality votes as well. And, the, re the way that we can see what a high quality vote is, is by something called the domain rating or the domain authority. And domain authority is a, um, a measure between zero and 100 about how uh, authoritative a certain website is. So if you think of the New York Times as being 90, 95 out of 100, very high quality, um, you know, all the way down to zero. You know, if you're a new website, you're probably 10, 20 or something like that, more established. As you get more established, then you go up from 20 to 30 to 40 and, and, and all the way up. But generally, 
if you are getting backlinks from websites that are 70s, 80s, 90s, then these are really, really high quality uh, votes. And this will help with your um, backlink strategy. It will help with your SEO. So getting these high quality links is really, really uh, difficult. Uh, it's labor intensive. It's time consuming. Um, in essence, what we're trying to do is basically contact lots and lots of these different high quality websites, build relationships with the journalists, write content and try to contribute to some of their articles in some way with the hope that they will backlink to your site, because not all of them do. Some of them do. But you can imagine if you submit, say, 100 um, uh, you know, piece of content for some of the uh, websites that you're targeting, maybe only a handful will end up backlinking for you. So this is why SEO agencies tend to charge a, you know, a high retainer because there's a lot of time and skill involved with building backlinks. So this is just a quick snapshot. As I said, um, you know, what we want to do is try to contribute to those uh, websites which have a high domain authority. Um, you know, if you type in domain authority checker into Google, you know, there are lots of different ones. This is just one here and you can just type in um, anything here, click check and you get the domain authority. So you obviously want to try to prioritize the higher ones over the lower ones. But, but you know, bear in mind that it's going to be harder to get into the higher domain authority websites than the lower domain authority websites. So, you know, you will then need to make a, a call whether it's better to have three links from a 50 domain authority website or one link from a 90. Um, and that's where it gets a bit more uh, difficult to, to, to figure out how best to use your time. But um, check the domain authorities, aim to get links from high quality um, publications, and this will be a, the major driver of your SEO um, performance longer term. So finally, I just wanted to, to um, just share with you something that uh, some of you will know, um, you know, help a reporter out. Uh, dot com harrow is something uh, that is a, is a really great resource and really what it is is it's a website that connects as it says here you know journalists are always writing stories um you know it can be obviously about the cleaning industry but obviously lots of different things but what you will find is that some of the journalists on this platform will be looking or, or writing a cleaning related story and will be looking for input or some quotes or some expertise from cleaning business owners to help them put together the story. And often, you know, these will be some very high quality publications. And, you know, as I said here, some of these were from Harrow. Um, so you can get very high quality uh, backlinks by using this um, this resource. Um, as I said, not every time you you um, you put put together some content and you know send it to them will you get a backlink. Um, you know certainly not every time, but you know if you're doing consistently, you will start to get more and more high quality backlinks here. So this is a really really um, great resource. Um, but uh, but I hope that's been helpful. Um, you know as. You know, if you've got any questions, just leave me a comment um, below the video. Um, I am also um, working or have the capacity to work with a very small number of SEO or a small number of cleaning business owners with SEO. Uh, so again, if that's something of interest, um, I'll drop some information uh, in the video uh, in, in the description field below. Many thanks.